Well, it is March Madness. You're used to seeing buzzer beaters, but normally it's on the hardwood. And in basketball, they've got that clock above the backboard. You don't have that in hockey. You're dead tired. Take us through the play. And how did you know how much time was left? Uh, I had no idea. Just uh, honestly, it was kind of nice that I didn't know. So I could kind of make my move and, and just made the move I wanted to make and was lucky enough that I had enough time left. Where are you at with your confidence right now? We saw your big weekend. We saw you get a bunch of chances tonight. You had a post earlier in this hockey game. For you as a pro player, this has got to be one of your best feelings you've had. Yeah, I'm feeling good. I think uh, puck's coming my way. I'm getting chances, and puck's going in right now, so that's nice. Um, just kind of trying to stick with it and not get too frustrated on the ones that aren't going. What does a win like this do for a team late in the year when you go on the road and beat a quality team, missing a couple of your best players in Spurgeon late? We knew that Kirill wouldn't be out there, but to play the way you did tonight as a group. Yeah, we played awesome. I think uh, we got faith in each other and everyone to kind of go out there and, and do their job, and it's it's been going well lately, just kind of next man up mentality, and we're doing a great job with it. You've played with a lot of good players over your career because you're a top player. With Marcus Johansson on your line, what is the ceiling for your group as you build here in the final month? Yeah, it's only getting better, I think, each game. It seems like it's it's plays that you know where guys are. It's, it's quick and easy, and obviously uh, Marcus is, is a hell of a player and making plays all over the ice. You're a hell of a player, too. Congrats on an awesome game tonight. Yeah, thank you. Red Hot, Matt Boldy, overtime winner in the closing second to get the Wild two points tonight in Newark.